Distinguishing elements and compounds. So here we are to decide whether each sketch shows a pure sample of an element or a pure sample of a compound. So let's look at what we have. So here we have four different substances. And we know that pure substances can either be elements or compounds. What's going to be the difference between the two? Well, a compound, by definition, is two or more atoms of different elements. Two or more atoms of different elements. In, an, in a pure sample that is an element, we only have one type of atom present. Only one kind of atom. Here we have two or more kinds of atoms bonded together. Okay? So let's look at substance A. I see a bunch of individual atoms here. They're all the same color, which suggests they are all the same kind of atom. That would be an element. Substance B. I see these molecules, and each molecule is comprised of two of these red atoms and one of the black atoms. That would be, by definition, a compound. Two or more kinds of atoms bonded together. Substance C. I have molecules, so I have two or more atoms, but to be a compound, I need two or more atoms of different kinds, of different elements. So this is a molecule, but it is not a compound because the atoms are all the same. So therefore, it would also be an element. Substance D also falls in the same category as substance, substance C. I have molecules, two or more atoms, but they are not two or more atoms of different elements. So again, I just have an element.